We are currently at the Temple of Apollo in Delphi and it is the most amazing thing ever. Oh, I don't even know if it's showing up on camera as cool as it is. I am so in awe of everything. Welcome to Greece. If you wonder how I spend my day, here's some clips of the things I do. If you don't care anyway, then well, this isn't about you. Hey look, I turned the camera on. That's the first time in two weeks, so what do you know? Um, hi, hello, I'm in Greece. Um, I'm currently at the American College of Greece. I've been here for just over two weeks um, and I have very little footage. Um, I just had a really hard time right when I got here. Um, I think I spent so much time preparing for this and working so hard to be here that once I finally got here, if every little thing wasn't perfect, it felt like I did something wrong and that was like a lot of pressure to have to deal with the first week, but I'm feeling better now. Um, so yeah, I just finished my second full week of school and it's been really awesome. I filmed a little bit, that clip you saw at the beginning was from a trip we took to Delphi, which was really, really awesome. Um, that's one of my favorite things I've done since I've been here. Um, but there's also been a lot of lows, highs and lows. And I'm hoping from this point forward, I'll have a lot of really awesome footage to show you guys of how amazing Greece is because it really is amazing. But I'd like to spend a minute now just talking about like my experience those first two weeks and what was good about it, what was bad about it, what was hard and things like that. So um, a couple of the hardest things the first week were um, adjusting to the time difference. Anytime from like 7 a.m. to 5 p.m., everyone back home is asleep, um, which is hard because those are the times at which you want to communicate with people. And so that can be really frustrating when it feels like there's no one there to talk to. Figuring out food was hard. I'm just like going to the grocery store and everything's in Greek. And I have learned a couple phrases in Greek, but I certainly by no means speak it. So um, that's a little bit of an adjustment. And then um, along that line, um, people speak in Greek around you. And it's like, I would never expect or ask them to speak English. I'm aware that like, I am the person that's visiting here. However, it can just feel very isolating when you're walking across town or walking even across campus and all you hear around you is a language that you don't understand. Um, so for me, a big solution to this was just putting headphones in when I walked class and that has helped so much. Just being able to control what it is I hear and what it is I interact with on my way across campus has infinitely improved my mood throughout the day. So those were kind of three of the big things. Um, some of the most amazing things. Let's talk about the good things for a second. Um, the school is beautiful. The teachers are excited to have American students in their class and that's awesome. Um, I love my professors, that's been really great. Um, on the flip side, the food. When you figure out what it is you're ordering or what it is you're buying, they have delicious, amazing food here. Um, today I had the awesome opportunity to go to the grocery store with a nutritionist that the school, uh, that works at the school and she just kind of taught us how to shop and she was the most amazing person. I learned so much and I got so much food. I'm so excited to cook these next couple weeks. Um, and then getting to travel. And this is like a little bit. We've taken a couple, we took a tour downtown and then we took a trip up into a mountain town, uh, Delphi and the Temple of Apollo. And it was amazing. Coming up soon, um, this coming, not this weekend, but next weekend, I'm going to Bulgaria. But yeah, I just wanted to update and say, that like, I'm so happy and so, so grateful to be here. But that doesn't mean that it's not the hardest and scariest thing I've ever done. And that it's, uh, there's a difficulty that comes with tackling every day here. And that's okay. And I'm like working through that and that's awesome. And you can be so happy to be doing hard things. That's like the biggest thing I've learned. Um, there's that little bit of footage from the beginning. I think I've got some more footage from Delphi. Uh, we're going to the port tomorrow. I'll try to film some of that to put it in here. If you want to hear more long form of my thoughts about my experience and things I'm learning and um, whatnot, the way my twisted brain works and all of the awesome things I've been learning here, those will be posted um, written on my blog. So if that's something you're interested in, go to notaboutyouonline.com and I'll be posting lots of pictures and thoughts there. But if you're interested in the adventures we're going on, I'll try to post more of those here.
ice pillar. <laughs> it really is. Good call. That means hello in Greek. Um, I just wanted to show you guys a couple of things. Today has been a terrible, crazy rainy day. This is like a total oddball. It never rains this much, but it has been today. So I just wanted to show you guys a little peek outside. Yesterday was like full on crazy, oh, the door's locked. Full on crazy rain. It was insane. But um, here is a view of our balcony on a rainy day like today. So this is the balcony, but you can see it's totally soaked. And then, got these, you can kind of see. But this is the balcony outside of our room over here. It's absolutely stunning and beautiful, but today it's very nasty and rainy. So hopefully I'll get to show you guys a better view on a better day. But yeah, this is what we're working with today. Um, it would normally be totally fine, but the bad weather is also affecting the Wi-Fi, which is not okay. Friends, it is Monday morning. I'm walking to class. Let's freaking get it. Um, so a couple cool things. Um, the campus is about not quite a mile from where we live. Um, I found a shortcut, so it's probably even a little bit shorter than that. But I have class every morning at like nine-ish. So I get up and I walk my butt up these hills and to the campus for a dance class that I'm taking. It's my first class of the day. Um, there's someone leaf blowing up here, so the sound is probably going to be terrible on this video, so I will talk to you in a bit. Now, this is the hill we walk up. I don't know if you can even tell, but it is steep, I promise. But it's very pretty. Sometimes I forget to just look up and admire how cool it is. Um, fun fact about Greece, there are orange trees that just grow on all the streets. So there's one right over here. Sure if you can tell, but they're beautiful. I right hear these two guys, these trees, super fun. I made it through class and I'm stopping at the grocery store on the way home because I'm out of milk. Hi guys, I am walking again to class. It's Tuesday morning. Um, thanks so much for watching this this week. It's been really hard getting adjusted and feeling like confident and ready enough to. Uh, do some stuff on camera, but I miss it. It's been fun. So, um, thanks for watching. In these next coming weeks, I'm hoping to get more footage up on my feet, doing exciting things. We start traveling this week, good stuff. And remember, if you're interested in my written thoughts, those are gonna be published at notaboutyouonline.com and I'll be trying to show you day-to-day -day life here. Thanks so much. I'll see you guys next week. If you wonder how I spend that day, here's some clips of the things I do. If you don't care anyway.